so high. Um, we were preparing to attack our final enemy, Phineas. Um, and in the beginning of this week, I've actually gone through the preparation phase, but did not record the video. So let me just describe what I have done. Um, I've taken creatures from seal as well as gem and I gathered them in yoke. Um, I was I was thinking about using gem but uh, <coughs> whenever I attacked Phineas with gem somehow the phoenix's fear in the first round so Phineas practically he is the one that starts the combat because my uh, phoenix is fear and that ruins all my plans so I decided to use Yog instead uh, and these are my creatures after I collected them from different towns and different heroes and if everything goes well uh, we can actually win the combat so let's begin right now um, I don't need to play these guys let's just win this combat so I forget to I forget to mention but basically um, I have the orb of what was that orb? Negativity, vulnerability. Uh, the orb that will remove all kinds of uh, spell immunities. So I have that spell, so I can use Berserk comfortably. And as usual, I'm gonna use my force field as well. And. I'll begin by killing the fairy dragons as quick as possible. And in the meantime, my other creatures will be crushed by the enemy. So the extensive archer skill of York really helps me a lot. So I have to play, be very careful right now. The first thing I'm gonna do is when it is my Asia Dragon's turn. I'm gonna cast haste, and thanks to the orb of vulnerability, all my creatures will be affected. Now my Asia Dragons has a speed of 31. This means that even if my phoenixes die, and they will, uh, I'm gonna be the one to begin the next round. And so the fairy dragons are gone. This is very important. And this way, we can keep erecting this force field. Um, you are gonna die anyway, you don't need to do anything. Now let's kill these titans. And from now on, we are going to be careful. Um, the first thing I'm going to do is... I'm going to cast another prayer. Because as you know, the prayer given by the Angelic Alliance, its duration is much shorter than what would it be with your spell power? So, 
it it was not gonna last for 99 rounds. Actually, it lasts for something like 10 rounds. So I just refreshed that prayer spell. So now I have both prayer and haste. We cannot shoot with the titans, which is not a big deal right now. My priority is to make the Asia Dragons truly invincible. Now they can't be blinded. The only thing the enemy can do is to cast a bless. Indeed, the bless can. Uh, sorry, not the bless. The dispel. This spell can basically cancel all these spells and I don't want that. Now we can start planning our attack now that the Age of Dragons cannot be attacked in any way. We can actually do Berserk we can start doing that and let's just watch these guys kill each other you see how quickly they kill each other this is great now I can actually spam all three creatures here I guess that's what it looks like This magic mirror means it can can it also bounce the Berserk spell? Uh, I don't know. Let's see. It didn't. see every time the red rust dragons attack the age of dragons their defense skill is a little reduced reduced by nine I guess that's great So you see Titans don't even need to shoot. Berserk makes everything easier and then there's this sacrifice spell. Something that I don't want. Uh, let's see. I should bring the Age of Dragons to here so that he can attack these two troops. Yeah, you keep resurrecting yourself. you can help the hit point, if the ghost dragons can help the hit point of Asia dragons, I would be so happy. No, 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 stay there. Yeah, that's nice.
Yes. decides to cast another sacrifice things will be easy 